Welcome to Day 17, Living Creativity. In today's world, we're always tempted to stack more and more stuff, more activities, more experiences into our day. But how many of those things are for fun? It goes without saying that we often neglect to schedule a little fun just for ourselves. I know I do. My goodness. Yet every day brings a chance for us to draw in a breath and kick off our shoes and even dance a little. Creative expression, meaning playtime and downtime, are really essential to having a vibrant life. And it's important that we make time for the moments that offer real joy in our lives. Today, Deepak talks with us about the importance of playtime and how it opens our hearts and minds to limitless possibilities, to new discoveries, to creative solutions, and the richness of abundance and love. So relax while Deepak shares more about the benefits of truly having fun. Then we'll enjoy our meditation together. How many of us really have fun every day? Time when we do nothing but relax, enjoy a good book, or listen to great music. Think back to when you were a child, perhaps exploring the environs of your block or neighborhood. Every bug, plant, rock, song you sang with your childhood friends, all of it was new. And each activity brought with it a flood of ideas and creativity. Experiences like these offer glimpses of the soul. They are rooted firmly in the present, impervious to time. As adults, such experiences continue to be important. Enjoying activities that have no external goals or milestones to reach enables us to dig deep into our own reservoirs of creativity and connect more deeply with ourselves and others. It is through play and experimentation that some of our best ideas rise to the surface spontaneously. We make a bold discovery, have the aha moment instantly visualizing the solution, or reconnect with our dharma, our true purpose in life. Try to remain open to being your most creative. Release your fears. Follow your intuition. Acknowledge the synchronicities that nudge us toward a new path. Entertain diverse perspectives. And let go of rigid, fixed beliefs. Allow the past to die so that you can live in this moment, today. Just as your body is changing in every moment, give yourself permission to choose a different way. Each new perspective, experience and insight fosters new brain patterns to support our desires and goals. And such wondrous transformations can only happen when we allow ourselves the time and freedom to create and recreate every day. Let's go now to the source of creativity, our spirit. As we prepare to enter into silence, let's consider our centering thought. Through rest and play, 
I open my creative channel. Through rest and play, I open my creative channel. Now let's prepare to meditate together. Sit comfortably and close your eyes. Take a few long, slow breaths and just relax. Begin to introduce the mantra, saying it silently to yourself. Om Anandam Nama Om Anandam Nama My actions are blissfully free from attachment to outcome. If you have thoughts, hear noises, or feel sensations, just mentally repeat the mantra. Om Anandam Nama. Please continue meditating. I'll mind the time, and at the end you'll hear me ring a soft bell. Om Anandam Nama. Om Anandam Nama And now, just in the mind.
Let go of the mantra and allow yourself some time to rest. Then, when you'd like, please open your eyes. Throughout your day, allow the mind to relax into the centering thought. Through rest and play, I open my creative channel. Through rest and play, I open my creative channel. Through rest and play, I open my creative channel. Namaste.